you know what? I'm not really sure if it's, um, uh, maybe it's a combo. Uh, but I'm certain that um, taking the dust cover off has made me want to touch and play this game a heck of a lot more than when I actually had it on. I think it was also, you know, due to the fact that it was uh, starting, you know, I mean, sometimes uh, you just, um, at least I just have to realize, um, may not be in the groove, or just may not be in, into it at that point. Um, and I mean, also right now, I'm just getting into the nice meat, uh, the stuff that I really enjoy. But yeah, it's just weird. I don't, I'm not, like, I like the dust cover and everything, but I think I'm not going to be, um, like, I'm going to use it, obviously, for, up, like I am. I'm using it upstairs for uh, Rob's, uh, uh, for our game there, the U.S. Civil War game. But I think I'm going to actually keep the um, the dust cover off of here. I just find it so much more inviting. It's not, it just seems, um, it just seems so much more approachable or something. I don't know what it is, but it just seems always like, you know, come, come play with me. And I'm like, yeah, no problem. Uh, I'd love to. Um, yeah, that's it. I'm just uh, right now um, just uh, assigning. Um, well, I'm just using the color things right now just so I could start to uh, visually, as I walk by, just a cursory glance and just take a look and go, uh, okay, which, uh, you know, which units are under uh, which. And Boy, I'll tell you one thing. The, the Warsh Army or Warsh Army, uh, he's going to have to start delegating. Holy smokes, that's a lot of units. Holy bull. But it's neat. Now I can start seeing like how many supply points are available uh, for that army. Uh, you know, available stre uh, strength points, uh, potential strength points from replacement uh, divisions. Um, la, 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 la. Where to put the core HQs, uh, you know, which ones to delegate and so on and so forth. Keeps uh, lines up and uh, just uh, the objectives and... Um, um, or their orders basically uh, the three uh, the thing the the three things are going to be um uh for this guy is to uh, pr uh secure the tritown area so that's uh Katowice, uh krakow and tarnov and then uh secondly will be to repair the rail lines and then thirdly uh to make a push for uh Kjeltze. uh the thing is i know that this is just the way it is it's not going to happen right now the big uh, the big offensive is not going to happen this turn i have to wait for the uh uh, the garrison troops to arrive. Uh, I think this guy's got something like 36 or 30 something uh, strength points available right now, uh, which is pretty interesting. But um, uh, what I still need to do, though, is I'm going to make some little attacks down here uh, just to keep the Russians focused down here. Feels kind of weird to go, OK, I'm going to be making attacks and it's not for the real. But who knows? Maybe I can find a little... Uh, chink in the armor well there is there's a huge one up there and um yeah this is going to be a coordination though with the eighth army up there so but uh yeah this is going to be fun as hell so it's not going oh my gosh i have to remember that cavalry my <laughs> it may not last very long uh so this is probably i'm not i'm going to say the big push or the big whatever towards kilts is not going to probably happen until uh oh four november so mid-november um, and then it's just going to be constant as far as I know. It'll be like 05 massive attacks still, 06 massive attacks, 07 massive attacks. But after that, uh, the, the other thing is to start begin, uh, begin entrenching and get ready for winter. That's, uh, that's it. All right. Having fun. Hope you are too.